Okay, I'm going to show you a way to speed up your SAMI S3 even faster than it already is. The first one has to do with the fact that every time you push the home key twice, it brings up S voice. What it's actually doing is waiting to see if you push it twice or not. So you push it once, it waits to see if you're pushing it twice. But I don't use S voice, so normally when I'm pushing the home key, I'm, I'm wanting it to bring me back home or do whatever. So what we're going to do is go into S voice click on settings and turn off launch S voice by double pressing. Now when we push once it responds right away because it's not waiting for to see if we pushed it twice. Next thing that we can do is go into settings again and this time go all the way down to developer options and all the way down to the bottom of developer options we have two things Windows scale animation and Windows transition scale. Now what happens is, is that this controls how your screens change. So for example, when I click on this, you may not have noticed, but there's a little animation. Let me just boost this up to 10 for a second. So there you go, so you can actually see it. Now mine originally was set to 1.5. Most of you have it set to 1. If you turn it to 0.5, you'll still get a little bit of animation, but it's a lot faster. And if you really want it to go as fast as possible, then just turn it off, and it just pops right up. So we're going to take Windows Animation, turn that, to, I'm, going to, I'm going to turn it off, you might want to change it to 0.5, and I'll turn that off, and now we have a little bit faster SAMI S3.